Ex-soldier Mr. Wallace has been among the names tipped for the new Secretary General of the Defensive Alliance to replace Jen Stoltenberg. Emmanuel Macron has been met with fury after it was reported that the French president is seeking to veto Ben Wallace being considered to be Secretary General of NATO. Mr. Wallace, a former soldier, has been tipped to take over from Jen Stoltenberg when his term comes to an end in September. Dot. But France is said to be opposed to any UK or Turkish candidates who might be up for the role. Tory MP Andrew Bridgen accused Mr. Macron of Anglophobia, telling Express.co.uk, while Macron's Anglophobia is disappointing, he is at least consistent. Another Tory MP told Express.co.uk that France's position raises questions for Prime Minister Rishi Sunak, noting that, meanwhile, David Jones, Deputy Chairman of the European Research Group, said anyone with a fair mind would recognize it's a good idea to have a representative of a major military power in that role. He added, the fact is, we are the second biggest contributor to NATO. We are the biggest military power in Europe. The MP backed Mr. Wallace, describing him as a highly competent person who is internationally respected. Mr. Jones added, I would have thought that the role would suit him, if that is what he wants. Meanwhile, Mr. Bridgen said the Defence Secretary would be ideal for the role of NATO Secretary General. He said, although I think Ben Wallace being appointed NATO General Secretary would be a huge loss to the government, I have no doubt that he would be ideal.